The guys hit the docks with their aluminum arc. Rough seas ahead. And a plan for one hail of a hailstorm. Now we've seen that a hail ball, even with a 300 mile per hour wind behind it, cannot put a hole in the boat. But what if we had a huge storm? What if a massive amount of hail dropped into the boat? Well, that's what we're doing out here at the Port of San Francisco. We're going to throw a boat in the water. That's perfect. We're going to make a huge storm, and we're going to see what happens. And they'll rustle up that record-breaking storm, courtesy of a freezer truck and a conveyor belt. All right, that looks good. This is our own special Mythbusters massive hailstorm right here. These bags of ice are in our refrigerator truck at exactly 27 degrees Fahrenheit. They're going to storm down this conveyor belt into the boat and hopefully sink it. Looking at that boat, I think we might actually have a shot at this. And with that, it's time to break the ice. You guys ready to bring the storm? We've got a hailstorm that's 20 pound bags of ice one at a time down the conveyor belt. All right, well, why don't we slowly fill it up till it gets up to the rim and see if that's enough to sink the boat. OK, fire up the conveyor belt. Here comes the hail. Woo, it's coming down in buckets. All right, that's 100 pounds. Well, we know the record amount of hail fall in an afternoon is four feet. That's 200 pounds. He's coming. So what we're going to do is fill up our boat completely to the lip with hail. 400 pounds. If it sinks, this myth is plausible. But if it doesn't sink, this myth is busted. Oh my god, it's almost filled. With the hail now piled three feet deep. I see the boat starting to dip a little. The boat is surprisingly buoyant, and Grant knows why. Here's the cap. See, the ice that we have, it's not just one big block. It's a bunch of little pieces. 500 pounds of hail, and it's still floating. Which means that air can get in the middle. So you're not entirely displacing the air as you would with water. All right, that's 600 pounds. But you can stack the ice higher than the edge of the boat. So at this point, it's not entirely obvious what's going to happen. So because ice can't fill every crack and displace all the air, if the guys stand any chance of sinking that boat, 1,500 pounds, still floating. They'll need to pile that hail high. That extra mass may overcome the boat's buoyancy. 